Hello everyone, today we are making curry chicken with white rice as requested by Carrie from Crafty Amina. Thanks Carrie. So to start off, I mixed um, a lot of translucent with a little bit of white and I rolled that into a snake for the rice. And I'm just going to cut off um, a few grains and roll them out with my fingers until they reach a kind of like oval shape. I didn't really film the whole part of this because I've already showed how to do the rice in the last tutorial, so I hope that's okay. Once you get enough of those, you can go ahead and pre-bake them. I took some tan colored clay and mixed it with a little bit of white and I just rolled that into a chicken cutlet like shape and I'm texturing it with a toothbrush and then I'm going to go over it with the dotting tool very lightly because I'm going to cut it up anyway. So. I decided to go with cutting them up into kind of like square shapes, but not perfect squares, as if it was really a chicken cutlet, like chicken breast piece. And then I just took each piece and took my needle tool and just scraped over it um, diagonally and horizontally until it kind of looked like shredded meat texture. Now take some female liquid gel and mix in some pastels. I used orange, a light yellow, a darker orange, a light brown, and a kind of um, ochre tan color to make the brown curry sauce. I also used a hint of dark brown. And you're just going to mix that up until you get the color that you want your curry to be, which ranges from a light brown to a kind of golden orange to a hint of red. And I'm going to go ahead and put some sauce on the plate. And then I'm going to use the rest of the mixture to mix in the actual chicken. Add a little bit more of the dark brown um, pastels and a hint of red to make the chicken pieces actually a little bit darker. And I'm going to go ahead and add this to the plate as well. Now take some Fimo liquid gel and a little bit of white pastels and mix in your pre-baked rice. And we do this so that they'll stick together and they'll stick nicely on the plate as well. It's going for kind of like sticky rice texture and you're just going to put, um, actually I put a piece of unbaked clay on the plate first and then put the rice on top to make it look more full. You can go ahead and just organize it to your liking. Once you've done this, you can add a little bit more sauce or you can um, add a little color to your rice if you like or however you want to do it. It's up to you. I'm just going to add a little bit more sauce to my plate because who doesn't love extra curry sauce? And then once you're finished with that, you can go ahead and bake and seal it with glaze and you're done. Thanks for watching and if you have any more requests for something you might like to see me do, go ahead and leave in the comments down below and I'll be happy to make it. Bye!